Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Imi and I make health and beauty videos. If you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook. And moving on to the video, today's video is all about my meal prep to lose weight and get shredded. Now this meal prep is ideal for someone who is super busy, has work, school or just a really busy life. Someone like me, I, because I work all the time and I'm also like finishing my internship at the moment, I'm super busy and eating healthy just feels really really hard if I don't meal prep. So today I'm showing you guys a quick meal prep. It literally took me under an hour to complete this whole meal prep. It doesn't take too long. You're just in and out of the kitchen and then you've got meals for like three to four days. You can actually make this for up to seven days, but I like to do it every three to four days because I like the freshness of the food. Um, but yeah, you can definitely make it for more days. Um, if you want to change up your proteins or vegetables, you can definitely change it all up. Um, if you're vegan or vegetarian, you can use some other um, options as well like chickpeas or anything like that but if you want to see my meal prep that I do weekly or every three to four days please keep watching so over here I've got some chicken I've washed it I've taken the fat off because I'm using thigh fillets you can definitely use breast pieces as well like last week I used uh, leg pieces for the exact same recipe so you can use any sort of meat that you prefer anything that's a lean meat would be great for weight loss and um, I'm marinating it with my favorite things here. I'm putting some garlic ginger paste, some lemon juice. I'm also adding some spices as well to season it up a little bit. And then I'm just going to mix that all up. Now to my uh, chicken here, I'm also adding some garlic, uh, like whole garlic, as well as some onions because when you cook these in the oven, they caramelize so beautifully and they taste like absolutely delicious in this recipe. And I'm also going to be adding a little bit of olive oil to my chicken as well. I'm not going to be adding any other oils while this cooks in the oven and I'm going to let it slow cook as well. So you don't need to worry about adding any spray oils or any unhealthy oils to the recipe. Now the vegetables that I'm roasting up today is one of my favorite, or two of my favorites at the moment. So I'm using some sweet potato, uh, which is our form of healthy carbohydrates for, for our meal. And I'm using a little bit of carrot. I've been like obsessed with having roasted carrot. My mum made it for me like a couple of weeks ago and I've been having it in my meal preps. It tastes absolutely beautiful with this chicken. So all I'm going to do is put some cracked pepper and thyme and I'm going to put a little bit of olive oil on my vegetables and I'm also going to be popping them in the oven to roast um, along with the chicken. So you can definitely uh, take the chicken out a little bit early if it's done. Um, on this particular meal prep, because my chicken was boneless, it cooked a little bit earlier than the vegetables. So I did remove it uh, halfway through and then I'm letting the vegetables cook as well. Now for my snacks, um, I love to have snacks. Please keep snacking. Have a small snack every three hours at least um, and that's going to prevent you from starving and from eat, overeating when you actually do eat. So for my snacks, I'm making some homemade hummus. Guys, this is so easy. I used to buy the hummus from the stores and ever since I discovered this super easy recipe, I've just been making it and it lasts me like more than a week. It actually lasts me two weeks sometimes. So all you need for this hummus recipe is one can of chickpeas. I'm using two cloves of garlic. I'm also using lemon juice of half a lemon. I'm using tahini. Tahini gives it that creamy flavor and texture and it's basically sesame seeds. I'm also going to add some cumin seeds and salt. 
I'm going to blend all of this up and I also added half a glass of water to this just so it becomes really really smooth and creamy. Now this hummus, I'm pairing it up with my favorite vegetables at the moment. Okay guys, that was my meal prep. It's super easy. There's not that many steps to it. If you actually have everything in front of you, cut up and prepared, it takes less than one hour to complete the whole thing. And the only thing left is the cooking time. And when you pop it in the oven, you can leave it in the oven to cook and you don't really have to do much. So you can do your own thing while you're while it's cooking, which is what I do. I hope you find my recipes helpful. I know they're quite basic, but honestly, because it's so easy, it keeps me sticking to it and I know I can prepare it very quickly. So I hope you enjoy my recipes. If you have any other healthy recipes, uh, leave them in the comments below. I'd love to try your recipes out. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you have any other requests, please also leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Bye.